All right, we're here at Sylvan Reservoir dancing. There's Ryan. Yo! Juan's here. You guys might remember uh, Ryan from the Plenty Gorge video. Ryan's gonna suit his bike a little more today. How's it going, guys? <laughs> uh, Juan, how you feeling, mate, after your crash? Better. That's good. If you hadn't seen it on my Instagram, Juan had a pretty nasty crash last weekend out here at Sylvan. I wasn't there, but apparently he was unconscious for over 10 minutes while the Ambos arrived. He went to the hospital for x-rays and all seems fine, thank God. Sean's with us as well. It's a bit of a crew today. And I'm excited, of course. Juan's just pointed out my new helmet, which is actually not my helmet, it's my wife's helmet. <laughs> and it's really goofy. Sylvan is located in Melbourne's outer east on the east side of Mount Dandenong. It's a beautiful rainforest environment with lots of lush loamy soil. I've also received my replacement drone from DJI so it's awesome to get into the air again. We decided to jump in the deep end straight up and hit Liar Liar, one of Sylvan's more technical and challenging gravity traps. Alright so things start out pretty low key. I've done this throw once. But it was very wet. But that was very fun. First up was a small jump off a few rocks, and this is actually where Juan axed himself last weekend. We headed further down the trail. This is my kind of trail, lots of berms, jumps and steeps. And it is so nice to be out here. Stage 4 lockdown does not feel that long ago. Goodness. I had a leech on me. Oh, oh my goodness. Blood on my hand. I was like, what is that slimy thing on my neck? It's a goddamn leech. We came to this pretty decent sized log drop, which is kind of a huck to flat. 90s free ride style, anyone? <laughs> Literally no one was making this corner. It was pretty hilarious. And Sean ate it. I bombed out my forks. And we decided to move on. Land on the back wheel. Down lower, there is more of the same. More steeps, more jumps, more burns. This trail just gets better and better. In most of these shots, I'm carrying a large camera bag on my back and a gimbal on my front. And that's about four kilos of camera weight. You can really notice the difference. <laughs> Inside line. Pile up. Alright, let's try that again. It'll probably look flat as on the GoPro. But this is pretty steep. Woo. Brian's hitting all the big stuff. So am I. The further you get down the hill on the trail, the more it opens up and becomes really flowy and super fun.
deep hole of liar liar. Ah, whoops. That was awesome. Meanwhile, I'd already crashed my brand new replacement drone. I couldn't believe it. It pulled up fine though, so thank God. Next trail up was Broken Hoe. This trail is new for all of us. So far, it looks awesome. across background so it's funny we got all these sweet bike hammers this time and that explains it he used to race log ride <laughs> not a log ride Woo! Ryan slay that corner oh. doing those big Step down with this backpack on is. Oh! <laughs> I don't know why I hit that. I mean, I just saw you. I was like, ah. Oh. Decided to finish the day up on JJ's. I've had loads of requests to ride this trail, so finally here is JJ's. <laughs> oh man, that was the wackest jump I've ever done. Oh, this is nice. Oh, oh can jump? Yes. Yes. Woo. Damn, I laid the bike down just then. Woo. Woo. That was big. That was really cool. I think that's me. Could not see what I was landing on then. Didn't hit your head or anything. I was super worried about Juan today. He was taking it easy and wearing a full face, but still, you have to take concussion injuries really seriously. Whoa. <laughs> Woo. Damn! Did he hit both? No. I hit, going to that. I hit the first. Yeah. Jumping with his bag on is so sketchy. This is sick. At the bottom of JJ's are two decent sized doubles, which we decided to session for a while. I think JJ's has to be one of my new favorite trails. We'll keep an eye out for this guy later. Here's me getting both doubles. I'm pretty stoked on that. And yep, then this happened. Pretty brutal crash, happened super fast. He is down. No. I was down the other end of the jumps and Ooh. saw it from afar. He seems to be okay. I never actually found out this guy's name, but hope you're all good, mate. Pretty rough spot to go down. I think I may have got it on camera. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no one will see it, don't worry. I'm perturbed by recent events, we continue to session the jumps.
by this stage of the game, we're all pretty beat, so we decided to call it. All right, so we're just heading home, back to the car at the bottom of JJ's. Still probably a little bit of gravity to wash off. Yeah. Woo. Couple of hook views. Well done. Sean, what's going on with this uh, custom chain guard thing here you got going on? I tried to make one of the pro ones and I don't know if it works or not. <laughs> Does it reduce the noise? I don't know. You've definitely dialed up the DIY factor. Yeah. That well, was a fun day, Juan. Yeah, no, it was good. Good to see you taking it a bit easy. Alrighty, that wraps up our day here at Sylvan. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. I am pooped. <clears throat> But this story doesn't end here. Before we headed home, I decided to give the drone one last fly and ended up crashing it into the forest and absolutely destroying it. I might end up doing a video on what actually happened, but for now, I think I'm gonna give drone flying a rest. Okay, well that's it for today. Like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. And I'll see you soon for more Tales from the Trails.